today I'm in London. I'm doing some Christmas shopping and I'm just about to visit Harrods. I probably won't do any Christmas shopping there, but I am excited to look around. I've been to Harrods before, but quite a few years ago now, so I'm really looking forward to exploring there again and I'm going to bring you guys along with me. So there's no price on it and there's a beautiful snowy sea. Look at all this white, it's all white. I have found the chocolate hall. Dusted almonds for £30. Is this £46.90? £46.90? £69. £18 for chocolate there. Ah, oh, look, this is cute. Stock here. I found a signature bear, I think it's a biscuit, and it's I'm now in the Christmas Harrods section. <laughs> These are cute, little space ones. I have a space themed Christmas tree. Got the tag. They have some very unique items here. Oh, is that a boat? Yeah. Is that a drinking flask? Yeah, I think so. Oh, I think Very interesting things to put on the Christmas tree. That's a very fancy bubble. <laughs> £16. And there's a of four little mini mint pounds for six pounds. So crowded in here. It was very crowded inside Harrods, which I imagined anyway, but it was a little hard to look around and film in there because it was just so busy. But now I'm going to continue doing some Christmas shopping around London. We've stopped in a place called Happy to eat, and I was really tempted to go for, um, where is it, Pina Fada, because I love Pina Fada. But it was quite pricey. And I thought this drink looks really interesting. I've never seen anything like that before. And then the desserts. I'm really torn between this one, this one, and cheesecake. My chicken Caesar salad, which looks delicious. I decided not to go for dessert in the end because I was just so full after that meal, but it tasted really nice. I really enjoyed it. And now I'm on the way to Waterstones. I saw these socks and thought they were really funny. Vincent Van Toe. I really love the box with the golden spines. So pretty. 
Really lovely gifts in here on Waterstones for anyone who's a book lover. I loved this TV show, Ghosts. And we've got the characters' costumes here. The Book of Mormon is one of my favourite musicals and tonight I'm going to be seeing another one of my favourite musicals, Back to the Future, which is another one I've seen a number of times and I'm really, really excited to see it again tonight. There's an actor who is in it, he's called Corey English, he plays as Doc Brown and um, I'm really hoping it's him because last time I saw it we saw a different cast member who was still really good but I really like Corey. Mmm, these smell really nice. There are quite a lot of Harry Potter shops in London, but I think this one is my favourite. It's called House of Spells, and there's an upstairs floor too that sells like uh, other gifts from other TV shows and Viking style gifts, which I think is really cool. We've just stopped for a drink and some cake and also my sister bought me the cutest teddy, it's a gorgeous cinema roll and it's just adorable, it's so soft, it's gorgeous and love. I'm now on my way to the show, I'm so excited, I can see the theatre in front of me now. Yes, I'm so happy I'm seeing the right cast members. I'm having to now film on my mobile phone. For some reason, my camera isn't allowed into the theatre, which I don't really understand because I bought it with me loads of times before and it's never been taken off me. But it's now sat in the locker room. absolutely love the show the cast were amazing as always if you ever get a chance i definitely recommend you seeing back to the future it really is just amazing i'm on my way home now i had a fantastic time in london and i'll see you in my next video